Hey, it's me. Chuck? Where are you? Early meeting. Look, I forgot my cell. Can you stick it in my briefcase? Uh, Blair's sort of in there right now. Which is why I need you to grab it. She can get curious, and right now is not a good time. Yeah, man, I, I will do. Great. I did knock, but you didn't hear me. We heard you, though. I'm sorry. Was it awkward? Are you trying to prove some kind of point? Yes, but I shouldn't have to. I'm just glad I got Chuck's couch scotch guarded. Now, if you'll excuse me, Louis Vuitton is doing metallic booties for spring. B. S. Talk to me. Tell me what's wrong. Chuck and I aren't connecting right now. You mean? Not just like that. But thanks so much for the constant reminder. Sorry. He's shutting me out. In his head all the time. Normally, I'd chalk it up to just him being him, but last week he went through something. And if he's still upset, I just want him to be able to talk to me. Well, how do you usually pull these things out of him? <laughs> Pretty much what you just heard since Fashion Magazine. I tried all my tricks. He's not interested. I just want to make him feel better. Everybody decent in here? Oh, okay. Ah, got it. What are you doing? Uh, my phone's dead. I was gonna use Chuck's. There's a phone in the living room. I know. I wanted to check a tweet. Wait. Wait, Chuck asked you to grab his phone when he called, didn't he? Chuck called? No. I mean, yeah, he called, but he was just wanted me to put his phone in his briefcase oh. so he didn't forget it. That's it. God, I missed that. What? Dating someone who's a horrible liar. So much easier. Chuck didn't want me to see his phone. Hand it over, Archibald. Nate. There's half a dozen calls from a number I've never seen and a message.